At times, malicious attacks or phishing emails come through that try to get information from employees by getting them to click on harmful links or attachments. Northwest ISD and most companies will never ask you to put in credentials by clicking on a link. If an email asks you to verify or reset a password, it should not be through a link. In fact, it is best practice to never click on links that are included in an email unless you know for certain the links are from a trusted source. It's important to be careful and cautious with emails that appear abnormal, even from other staff members. A good rule of thumb is that if it feels strange, it probably is. It's better not to act and wait to confirm the email is legitimate. Employees are responsible for proper email security and should report any phishing attempts to help desk or via the Mimecast menu in their Outlook application. So as you can see in your Outlook application, if you get an email that appears from an outside source, first you'll see a caution bar that tells you that it came from outside the organization. It will also give you the sender to alert you who it's from. It will let you know to click a fish alert if you don't recognize it. Also, as you can see in this email, this is a targeted phishing attack. It is asking me to approve something via a time frame and it references another person in the organization. They obviously have sent this email based on information they found on the website. When I hover over the link to click on it, it tells me the domain is webdirect.com, which is not a domain that I recognize. This to me looks like a phishing email. So I will go up to this Mimecast menu and click on report phishing. This will report the message as phishing and submit it to NISD staff for analysis. You can also do the same action from the Outlook web application. All the same information appears. For this case, the URL appears at the bottom left and I can see webdirect.com, which I still don't recognize. To find the Mimecast menu, you click on the More Actions dots, click on Mimecast, and then Report Phishing here. The first time you click on Report Phishing from either the web app or from the Outlook application, you'll be prompted to log in using your NISD email address. And report as phishing. This will remove the message from your inbox and report it to NISD staff. Once you've reported it, the message is gone and you're good to go. You can also see that it has been removed from the regular application as well. If you have any questions, reach out to NISD Help Desk for assistance. Thank you.